Well, hey folks, species have been here, um, nuts. Yeah, apparently the AI is, uh, there we go. Woohoo! <laughs> yeah, the AI is out to get me, I tell ya. I do hope everybody's doing well today. We got, uh, Driz is on in the moment, we're on the uh, server, and Delirious was on, but I had to go and check something or other, so I'm sure he'll be back. Alright, I can't get there from here, is what this road's telling me. Oh, I'll tell ya, I've uh, had about a quarter of that field done by the hired worker, no problem. I mean, they drove all over the field, but as they don't do damage, it didn't matter, and they were doing an excellent job. And as soon as I go and start a different job, I get a little notice pops up that they're blocked by an object. And I'm thinking, an object? What could possibly be in the field? And, uh, no, he drove it into the ditch. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. There we go. All right goofy bugger. Maybe I'll uh, run one more headland here or something. I don't think it'll help, but you know. Gotta give him a chance. said up to this point he didn't seem to be having any issues as you can see there's a fair bit done I mean I did this end doing the uh, the headlands around the field but like that end there but the other side I think he got a good half dozen rows in anyway so who knows all right Now, I mean, I have to do all this elaborate turning because I can't drive back on the crop or I'll ruin it. Whereas, like I say, the hired workers don't wreck anything. Oh, consensus seems to be, by the way, that we just leave the darn weeds off until Giants figures out how to control them. And quite frankly, I couldn't agree more. But uh, you guys all got to pitch in now and uh, compensate us for the, the weed killer tanks that we bought. <laughs> All right. There. Now that's enough headland that my grandmother can do this field with the harvester. Good Lord, she's been dead for three decades. So, better hope the AI's better than the, you know, a dead grandmother. All right. Now... Pretty good. Let's get you hired up. All right. Now, where was I? Well, I was doing this, wasn't I? Is everything still down? It looks like it is. You should be able to just progress. This is quite the set, eh? This is that Lamertus set. Or no, the, um... What the heck is it called? Yeah, vehicle inspector is something else I gotta throw on here, or whatever the heck they call it. That was one that I forgot in our original, but tomorrow morning I will be adding some mods. What the heck is the name of this thing? Viking, I no remember. There it is, Framist Pack. That's what it was. Not the Lamertus, the Framist. Oh, no, 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 go back. <laughs> oh, it was fun while it lasted. No, it wasn't. All right. It's, um... A little bit of a pig. Now, I mean, you can tow these separately, obviously. But, I mean, it does such a beautiful job together. Got the big JVC for this. But, uh... Yeah. 
Not sure it's the best choice for fields that are constrained by, well, ditches full of water and such, although this field actually isn't, is it? I've got a fence at that end, I've got trees at this end, but I don't actually have a ditch. Hmm. But I am going to have to get some headland together here, because this is... Like I say, it's a bit awkward because of the length, eh? I don't know that I'll be able to hit the end of the field. No. Hmm. Ah, oh, really? Jeez. Once I get a little bit of uh, leeway here, I'll do headland down the sides as well, obviously. But for the moment, it's just trying to uh, get some room to turn this 700-foot-long train around at the end of the fields. <laughs> but that's all right. This will keep us busy. This will keep us busy. This is the field that... Uh, was supposed to have a bunch of dinkles or something on it and turned out they'd already been taken away so I don't know about that <laughs> feeling a little ripped off just a little now this one I might actually be able to sneak a sort of a corner in hey eh? there now I might be able to get our first headland going I mean, it's pretty easy to use other than that turning because it lines up nicely with one side of the tractor. Right. So yeah, as long as I keep this along the edge, we're doing pretty good. It's when we get to the ends that it gets bothersome. Yeah, if you find a link to the Follow Me mod that's got a, a multiplayer thing on it, bud, let me know, eh? Oh, sure, well, yeah, I that was my boo-boo. Um, the same with GPS, it's an al allegedly multiplayer friendly, but it's still a self-built, so huh. full of caveats. Huh. Alrighty, well, if you notice it's ready or they get a new, or a new version number, let me know, man. Quartz. It's uh, really hard to back this thing up as well. Yeah. Mind if I come pick up some lime at your lime station? No, go ahead. How does this? Oh, okay. This side lines up a little bit differently. Take eh? it there before the bridge is just meant to go up again. Yeah, this has got to be way over on this side, eh? Oh, it's going to take some getting used to. Does it have like a change side, lift, fold, allow, blah, 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 blah? Nope. I didn't think so, it doesn't really make sense with this, but just because of the way the the actual rig is set up. I'm trying to sneak it over a little bit at a time here. <laughs> now, that should actually leave me enough to get to the end. Oh, it's a drag. It keeps dragging the plow in, doesn't it? Hmm. I should have lifted that. That's what I should have done. 
like so. Try this. And drop it down. There we go. I just gotta remember to raise it before we get to the oh uh, really. Go straight, go straight, go straight, go straight. There we are. Flaky. <laughs> Ooh. I thought for sure we were gonna miss that part. Yeah. There goes Delirious on his way to get some lime. Awesome. I guess I should check and see how my uh, corn guy is doing. I haven't seen anything pop up going, uh, you know, hey, by the way, Dopey drove into a ditch again or anything, so we'll have to see. Once I get this row done, I'll turn him around and we'll take a quick leap over there. Yeah. One could almost regret buying the uh, one of the smaller corn headers in the bunch. <laughs> Almost. <laughs> yeah, I know I don't. Oh, that tree is just going to be annoying, isn't it? There we go. No, that's not going to do it. Come on. Let's see if we can T-bone the whole mess. That's better. Oh, I hope this tree's not... Please let me drive through you. You did. Good. What was that, bud? Hope you get a commission on the line you're selling here. Oh, you can't buy any? Yeah, I can buy it. Huh. Thing, I hope you get a commission. Oh, I didn't pay for the stuff. I don't care. It's a long drive to get lime. I hope you got a big container. Oh yeah, I took the largest of the, the first uh, bradles. Okay, let's get ready to... Uh, 14,000 liters. Well, there's a point. You can add the lime to auger wagon mods. Quite a good one for that. Yeah, right on. Anything you want to add, man, just leave it in one of the video comments, because I can't remember things for more than about nine or ten minutes, you know? <laughs> yeah, it's quite a good plan, actually, because I come up with all sorts of ideas, but by the time I come to take them, you're usually a lot simpler by that point. Okay. Oh, <laughs> there he goes back. <laughs> hey, there he is. <laughs> That's funny. Okay. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, well, it doesn't matter. I'll be driving over that part anyway. I just think I dropped that. I keep forgetting that it actually loads up to the back one. So I need to pull all the way forward. I'll get it done by the time this field's done. Oh, right. Yes, I assumed that was, well, I'd hoped it was this as opposed to, oh, hey, he's sitting in a ditch, but as I said, I didn't notice anything come up, so I think we're going to look. This is the next field that's going to have to get that uh, cultivator and plow treatment. That's fine. There we are. That should allow him to get underway. I've also started doing this, cutting my first meadow. So that's something else I've got to finish before the grass grows back through it, as is bound to happen. Uh, what else? Ah, uh, yes. Uh-oh. Well, I guess good thing I stopped, because apparently... 
I'm starting to mess it up, man. There. Give it the benefit of the doubt and run a little wide. Beats a heck out of having to do it again. So I think in the next couple of days, I'm going to go out and do a little bit of testing for my outdoor programming. And we missed a section. Dang. quite surprised it actually dragged itself into the right position there. I thought for sure I was going to have a big plowed chunk at the edge. Nice. I mean, if I have to run up and down the headland once or twice, that ain't going to kill me. Yeah. I'll tell you one thing, though. There's no way I'm pressing the H on this project. I wouldn't trust the hired help to be able to do this for anything. Not a chance. Sure, we actually get her all plowed. Perfect. Up you come. Get the rest of it cultivated. Whoops. <laughs> I wasn't expecting to turn that sharp. This is going to really bung it up in it. There we go. Big S turn because they just love doing that sort of thing. Here we go. Alright, so I want to drop the back end on, preferably. Yeah, that's fine like that. That works much better. I said I figured out before we finish the field. <laughs> eh, we're not even close to that, so pretty proud, pretty proud. So what are you up to? I guess he was talking to me. <laughs> oh, do I have... Um, hmm. Okay. I think I don't. That's alright. I'm trying out that Framist Plow and Cultivator pack. It's pretty good if you don't mind dragging around something 100 feet long. Good when you use it, but if you have a hired worker, it will miss. And... Oh, I don't think I yeah, dare the hard hire him. Yeah, gets a bit confused because it's quite a big offset. Yeah. But, um... It actually leaves smaller slices at the end of the field than the in game one, so it's not a bad compromise. Huh. Just not the tidiest jobs. Okay, back on we go. A little bit off, but not too bad. There we go. So, does a better job than I thought with this thing, does it? Right on. That's cool. That 
is very cool. I might try them on the other field, do a bit of a headland around it, and then throw them in it. See how it ends. See how it all ends. Okay. Let's just get the end of this done. Nice. Up with you. Ooh, just enough room. And I lied. There we go. Oh, that is still up. Whew. I just thought about that. That would make a nice mess. But I did raise it, so. Alrighty, let's get the back of her on there. Nice. Boom. There, that's better. Okay, that was quite bizarre. I heard my name and then play around with it. <laughs> uh, with the mass weight. Oh, yeah, yeah. I was going to mention that in the video, but yeah. Um, I don't know if it would be a good or a bad thing, but the way the mass mod. The mass mod. Yeah, this map's so flat, I don't know that it would make any difference at all, would it? I was wondering if it would affect rolling resistance, but that might just be me geeking out again. Well, we'll certainly give it a poke. I gotta add uh, that vehicle inspector mod too, or whatever the heck it is, I just forgot. Um, well, it's working for me. Yeah, me too. <laughs> what? <laughs> Why does it never work for me? <laughs> Just lucky, I guess. <laughs> You're so quick, you can't keep up with yourself. Oh, that's, that's just brilliant. Look at that car. Maybe you have to go into your XML and see where it's located or... Well, the last time I actually had to re-add the mod, I'll try that again. Now I've got a car that's driven right in between my plow and cultivator and I can't go anywhere. I hate these AI traffic. can't believe I hit the plow. How annoying. Uh, 
that was really annoying. Alright. Oops, let's make sure that's lifted up. Good. Now... stuff back together here. I thought I lowered it. Oh, it's still on the back one. Oops, mama sticky. There we go. Now we should be humming along. Yes, perfect. Perfect. Well, guys, I think I will end the episode here. I'm going to uh, carry on a little bit. Hopefully I get some work done between episodes. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, please hit that like button. Nice to come on when other people are actually uh, playing. So, uh, yeah. I'm going to uh, get this plowed up. And I'm thinking I might go cotton. I never did get to do anything with it on the last map. So, and this one's huge. So, <laughs> we'll see how that goes. Take care of each other, folks. And ciao for now.